Ospreys retained their place in top spot in the Pro 12 on Saturday with a win in Munster and now they're preparing to face Zebra in Italy on Friday night. Join us now at Landarsi as we look ahead to the game with Chris Gibbs, Morgan Allen and Hanno Dirksen. Morgan, a very tough 80 minutes out in Munster on Saturday and a hard-earned win but no chance to rest because we're out to Italy and another tough game on Friday night. I mean definitely it was a great result out in Munster, you know, it's, it's not, a, not an easy place to go. And we, we sort of picked up the win out there, which is which is a big thing that we needed. And then we've got to do the same out in uh, Zebra now on Friday. We found out for ourselves last season how difficult it is out there. A lot of people talk about a shock result against Elsa on Saturday, but there's no shock to us because obviously we've been there and done that. Yeah, I mean, you know, last game of last season was not a not a great thing to be watching. Uh, it's not the sort of result you want, but you know, again, they, they prove what they can do if you give them a chance. It's about preparing for this properly and treating it just the same as we did Munster last weekend. I mean, you always got to take it one game at a time. You always got to, you know, look who you're playing and figure out a way out to, to best deal with them. And yourself, you know, you're making a big impact when you're coming on. Are you enjoying being involved in this winning run? Oh, definitely. I think it's the most games I've ever won in a row, actually. So uh, it's nice to nice to pick that up. And nice to be involved in just around the environment and stuff. It does change things quite a lot. It's an opportunity now on Friday for you to. Take a claim for a shirt with Cardiff Blues home next week and then Europe is a chance for you to really put a, send a message to the coaches. Oh definitely, I mean it'll be the first uh, you know, first start of the uh, the sort of league season. Um, so it'll be a good chance to you know, get a bit more time in and you know, put a bit more of a marker down for the next sort of uh, few weeks. And there's a real battle between you and Dan for that shirt, you know, how are you enjoying that? Oh it's brilliant, I know it's just great pushing each other you know, every session, every game and stuff, just trying to you know, develop and, and get better. But ultimately, it's what happens on the pitch for the team is the most important, of course. Oh, definitely. I mean, as, you know, it doesn't really matter who plays, you know, but as, as long as we just keep picking up the wins and uh, keep playing well. You've all got a part to play if you're on the bench, if you're starting, or if you're just part of the squad. Oh, definitely. I mean, rugby's definitely developed into a sort of 23-man game these days. You know, it's, the bench is just as important as the uh, starting 15 sometimes. Join us at the Liberty Stadium as old rivalries are renewed when the Ospreys take on Cardiff Blues on the 12th of October. Kick-off is 4pm. Make sure you come down to the Ozone before the game for your chance to win free Frank and Benny's meals for kids aged under 12. Alternatively, the Black and White Lounge makes a return after a successful last season, including the Black and White Lounge as a match ticket, two-course meal and a Q&A with Ospreys players. To book your spot in the Black and White Lounge for this game, just contact Amy Lewis from the Ospreys commercial team on 01792 616 507. Prices start from just 59.99. If you're an Osprey supporter who can't commit to a season ticket because of work or family commitments, then we've now got the answer for you. The new Flexi ticket introduced this week allows you to pick four matches and pay for just three. That's right, you get 25% off. It's a fantastic offer and all home Pro 12 and European regular season matches are included. For full information, see the website now or contact the ticket office. Chris, a hard-earned win in Munster on Saturday. What's the reaction from the coaches after a few days of looking at it? Yeah, uh, we're really happy. Obviously, uh, going out there to, and, and picking up that scalp of Munster is a, you know, it's a, it was a tough ask, and it was uh, really stepped up. Performance-wise, we've left a bit out there. We're, we're not overly happy with some of the stuff, but uh, you know, we'll take that and keep moving forward. But small steps at this time of the year, just building week on week. Yeah, and, and with a young group, you've got to do that. You can't get too far ahead of yourselves. Uh, you can't assume anything, and we just make sure that preparation uh, is thorough every week. And uh, you know, we're just we're basically preparing to win. And if anyone is getting ahead of themselves, if ever there's a fixture like they bring you down a peg or two, it's Zebra away. As Ulster found out last weekend. Yeah, and uh, and you know we've come unravelled out there as well. So um, you know we we definitely. Have, you know, we're not taking this lightly at all, we're preparing, um, it's going to be a tough game, we've got a lot of travel, um, there's a lot of excuses here that, for us not to perform, but what's important is that uh, we build on the momentum we created last week and uh, you know, we get out there and perform how we need to. 
and we're looking further ahead then. The Blues home the following weekend and then we're into Europe. It's a tough game, so there's no margin for error. No, no, and uh, you know, it is exciting too, you know, we've, we've got this tough game out in Zebra and then we home to the Blues, so you know, again, it's just uh, something to look forward to, but uh, you know, it, it is a tough little uh, run coming. And I think the message going out to the players at this moment in time from what I can pick up on the camp is just keep on doing what you're doing, keep yep. working hard and we'll get there. Yeah, head down, ass up, and uh, you know you can't shoot hard work, and I think that's you know for us that's what it's about, and you know we've just got to we got to prepare to win every week, and uh, you know we just don't shoot anything, so you know it's just we got to keep our feet firmly on the ground and just keep working hard. I know Zebra on Friday night, um, painful experience we had it there last year, so it's a chance to go out there and, and try and get an improved result this time. Yeah, it's going to be a long trip there coming um, back from Ireland, uh, but hopefully we can put in a good performance um, and make it five from five. It'll be a, it'll be a good, uh, good push into the next game. Always good to go there off the back of a win in Tottenham Park, always a diff difficult place to get a result. In Munster, yeah, it's uh, the crowd there is kind of like dragons, you know, always shouting at you and stuff like that. But um, it was it's very a very tight win, and uh, we, we were very happy to pull it off in the in the last uh, last couple of minutes. A lot of praise coming our way at the minute from outside of the camp, and it's turned from nobody's now to contenders. But I think within the camp, everyone's been very level-headed about what the expectations are this season. Yeah, well, it's just no point trying to, you know, think we're the best team in the world after four games. Um, you know, anything can can turn around quickly and lose four games in a row. So we just got to stay stay positive, work on our weaknesses, and uh, hopefully we'll we'll be good. And for you, a chance on the weekend, starting a chance to actually make an impact and try and nail down a place before the Blues and Europe comes around. Yeah, I haven't had much time um, on the pitch this this year uh, yet, but uh, hopefully we can. Have another another start this weekend, and uh, it's not it's not too bad. Just as long as uh, the team keeps winning and we keep performing well as a team, and uh, get a couple of minutes here and then uh, contrib contribute to the team, uh, it's a good thing. That's all for now. Don't forget the Ospreys are at home against Cardiff Blues on Sunday, October the 12th, kick off 4pm. Tickets are on sale now from all the usual outlets, so make sure you get there and support the region.